Hello, all right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my stumps. World of Tanks Xbox 360 replays. Today we're platooned up with Scam Finder 5000 in his VK 4502B, Provo Cat Tech in his T30, and Doyok in his Centurion. And we are on Siegfried Line, which I hate that map, but that's where we are, and uh, we're gonna see what happens here. We're gonna push right up to the town or close to it as we're reloading this monster T-57 I love this tank I actually played it I haven't played World of Tanks a ton in the last probably four weeks but uh, I actually played this three or four games the other night and had three or four horrible games well I couldn't say horrible but they weren't good that's for sure I just couldn't seem to have a decent game in it uh, I don't know if uh, the tank just because I haven't been playing, you know, maybe uh, I'm just not used to it anymore. I'm going to let that T-32 go by me because he keeps on staring at me, which means that he's not watching the people in front of us. So if he's too busy watching his teammates run around circles, you know, turn his turret around circles, he's not going to do much for us. Provo's over there in his T-30. we got Doyok down beside us in his Centurion. And like I said, uh, Scam Finder is in, in his uh, VK. And I'm not sure. He went off to in front of me over there. On the other side of the building. And I'm going to play this, this game slightly safe. Because I hate this map so bad. Um, it just... If your team does not... If you do not have a good team on this map. And the other team has a decent team. You're going to get raped. Every time. I take a shot down there and miss, and uh, I'm going to get out of dodge, because I'm the only one right there, and I've learned on this map, do not stick your nose out when there's two or three tanks sitting there. I think that's part of the reason this map just plays out so bad sometimes, is if you don't have support, and you come up against a tank that has three or four, you know, support tanks with them, you just get rocked, which is, it's common sense, you know, they're going to rape you, but, uh, you've got to move around and find a new place to go because if you try it if you don't attack in a in a, in a group you're gonna lose we bounce one and then sink one and then sink another one so we took about 700 and something out of out of him and uh, I'm watching off to my right because it looks like uh, something's trying to come around that corner a conqueror and uh, I'm trying to hit reloading but as usual, that the wheel just sucks. Because if you're aimed at anyone, an enemy, or anything near you, it's not going to work. We uh, sink one into him, but doesn't do anything at all. So we're going to go after the E100 again. We put him on fire. Take another chunk out of him. He saves himself, and of course I leave him with what? 20 health. Of course, that's just how it works. I know I'm a broken record when it comes to that. But it's just... It's just total bullshit. But I mean, the game does it to keep tanks in the game. To keep, but it's just, you know, it's like I've said before. If you have a chance to kill a tank with, like, an autoloader, you have a chance to kill a tank. I'm never gonna do this. I'm trying just to track him. It didn't work, so I said, well, I'll try to point through his cupola, try to track him again, and we do track damage, but we don't track him. It, like I, was, I started to say, if if you're in an autoloader, you'll notice it horribly. If you know you can kill a tank in four shots, one of them's going to bounce. Oh, no, let's, let's do it this way. If you know you can kill a tank in three shots, and you're fully loaded with four, one of them's going to bounce, two of them are going to have decent rolls, and one's going to have a low roll, so you don't do the finishing damage. I can't get a shot there. The pillar's there. Nothing there. There's no sense of me even shooting at that. I mean, it's a hard enough target to begin with. I'm trying to just track him. Keep him tracked. Play the support role. But I can't even... I can't even track him. 120mm gun on this. I can't track him. I... Yeah. Do -do 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 -do. I hit him, I think, what, four times in that track? Did track damage twice, still didn't track him. And I know he's got two sets of tracks there, so 
I mean, I, I understand it. But still. Yeah, shooting from the inside. It just... A Conqueror come around. I want to get a shot at Doyok, I think. I'm going to pin one in him. And we're going to finish him off. You're welcome, Doyok. And we're going to finish off that uh, M103. And I'm going to reload. Because I only have one shell left. So, uh... They smelled blood when they saw a Doyok there. And a Centurion with low health, so they all come running. And guess what? They didn't know there's a T-57 fully loaded right behind him. <laughs> and with two tanks at a low... Low on health, four shots are going to do it. Pretty much most of the time. Now, if they had been half health... No, it wouldn't have worked. I'm going to finish off the E4. Pull him through his lower plate and finish him off. So now, hey, we're not doing too bad. Three of us in the platoon are still alive. We only lost one so far. And that, uh... Would be Doyok. He uh, stuck his nose up there a little too far and that E4 finished him off. I tried to get the shot as quick as I could, but... We got a Ramatan Borsik coming up over the hill there, and we miss him, of course. But we finish him off with that shot. And one shell left, and I hit reload. That's a big thing with this tank. You need to stay reloaded. You gotta reload constantly. Because if the way World of Tanks is, if you come into a battle and you don't have four shots, you know, and... If it's going to take three to kill him, you're not guaranteed to kill him. Because one of them's going to bounce. And, like I said, one of them's going to have a low roll. So, game's pretty much over. And, of course, we got two idiots capping. As usual, you fucking noobs capping when uh, there's no reason to cap. What is it? Nine on one. I'm going to jump off this. Wah! I know I shouldn't have done that, but the game was over anyway, so... <laughs> That's the only damage I think I took all game. Well, yeah, we end up, uh, three of us in the platoon staying alive. And, uh... Pretty good game in the T-57. Um... Again, I think I should have done a little bit of track damage to that, uh, T-95, but... You know, it is what it is. It's World of Tanks. We end up with, uh, 6,400... XP... Uh, without premium and without the multiplier. 9,700 XP with a 5 times multiplier. Uh, 42,000 silver. And, uh, end up killing four tanks. Uh, six critical hits. Track target hit was one. So maybe I did track him at one point. I don't know. We ended up doing 3,400 damage. Uh, four kills. Uh, Provo came in first with 5,400 damage. And uh, Scam finally came in, what, fifth or sixth there? Doyuk was down towards the bottom of the list, but that's that just happens sometimes. The Centurion one's a good tank, but just sometimes if you overextend it, you know, and the other team sees blood, they'll just kill it because it's an easier kill. So, But overall, we did decent, and uh, it was an alright game in the T-57. So... I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to try to get a few more videos out. And like I said, I have that, uh, I have the winner all picked for the contest. I just have been lazy and haven't done a video on it yet. So I haven't even let the person know. So I'll get to that in the next couple days here. As usual, comment or subscribe. Thank you for watching the videos. Um, hit a like if you liked it. Tell me if you didn't like it. Tell me what I did right. Tell me what I did wrong. And remember, when you're on that battlefield, shoot the red ones.